Hey, what's good, fam? Kyle Henderson of BamaInsider.com. First thing I want to talk about is Tyler Harrell. Where was he yesterday at practice? I wouldn't read too much into it. It's a small segmented time of windows uh, that we get to see practice footage. So he just might have not had B-roll yesterday. I wouldn't read too much into it. If there's anything that we need to report on, we'll bring that right here to Bama Insider. First look at Alabama wide receiver Jermaine Burton during the fall camp training season. We think that he's going to be Alabama's number one wide receiving target for Bryce Young. Comes from Georgia. There wasn't a lot of production just because of Georgia's offense, but you look to Jermaine Burton, what he could bring to Alabama. Look for him to be that big play threat. Number 11 is Treshawn Holden. Very dependable wide receiver for the Alabama Crimson Tide. Had a couple opportunities last season. Stepped up, made some good catches, has good continuity with Bryce Young. Isaiah Bond, when you talk about speed, this wide receiving unit has a lot of younger guys that are burners. Isaiah Bond, certainly one of those. He's number 17. You have Shaz Preston. Shaz Preston really caught my eye specifically yesterday, and I think yours too. Checks in at six foot, 190 pounds, wears it well. I wouldn't be surprised if he's closer to 200 pounds. Alabama needs some bigger wide receivers depending on the situation. And how Coach Saban has always recruited wide receivers is kind of almost like a basketball team. You need guys who are your power forwards, guys who are your point guards. And that's when you look at the wide receiver room for Alabama. You have the JoJo Earls, the smaller wide receivers at the slot position, uh, your bigger guys on the outside, Really impressed uh, just with the early footage from Shaz Preston, to be honest. Uh, you got JoJo Earl, speaking of a slot guy. Um, should get a lot of opportunities this year for the Alabama Crimson Tide. Here he is collecting a couple passes from Bryce Young. You're going to see him at that slot position. Has a lot of speed, a lot of agility. Um, also plays special teams for the Crimson Tide. Look for him to be a punt returner, I would assume, this year just because of the agility that he brings. Um, right here getting a pass from Jalen Milrow, who has switched his number from Two to four is Christian Leary. Christian Leary probably can be split out on the um, outside, maybe the X position. Um, also a slot receiver. So I think uh, Christian Leary should be having a big year. And then Ja'Cory Brooks, very steady last year, came up big in crunch time situations. Just an early look at the wide receivers from the footage that we received from Alabama's first practice. Hit the thumbs up, like, subscribe, fam. We appreciate you guys more than you know. Sticking with us right here on the Bama Insider YouTube channel.